Virginia Dufresne has praised a court ruling which allows her civil case against Prince Andrew to go forward. Virginia Dufresne, 38, took to social media to claim she would expose the truth in a civil case brought against Prince Andrew, 61. Ms. Dufresne has alleged the Duke of York sexually abused her when she was 17. Prince Andrew has vehemently denied the accusations. Writing to her 96,000 Twitter followers, Ms. Jufri said, I'm pleased with Judge Kaplan's ruling yesterday that allows my case against Prince Andrew to go forward. I'm glad I will have the chance to continue to expose the truth and I am deeply grateful to my extraordinary legal team. Their determination helps me seek justice from those who hurt me and so many others. My goal has always been to show that the rich and powerful are not above the law and must be held accountable. She added, I do not walk this path alone, but alongside countless other survivors of sexual abuse and trafficking. The comments come after New York Judge Lewis Kaplan, 77, dismissed the Duke of York's contention the case against him was legally insufficient. Andrew's lawyers requested the civil lawsuit be thrown out after claiming Ms. Jufri waived her right to sue after she signed a $500,000 settlement agreement with Jeffrey Epstein, who died aged 66 in 2019, in a previous case. Wednesday's ruling means Prince Andrew will continue to be involved in legal proceedings for the foreseeable future. Following the decision taken by Mr. Kaplan, Buckingham Palace said in a statement, with the Queen's approval and agreement, the Duke of York's military affiliations and royal patronages have been returned to the Queen. The Duke of York will continue not to undertake any public duties and is defending this case as a private citizen. A royal source confirmed the decision will mean the title of His Royal Highness will be dropped and Andrew's roles will be redistributed to other members of the firm. This includes a dozen military affiliations, including his role as Colonel of the Grenadier Guards. The decision came shortly after anti-monarchy campaign group Republic obtained signatures from more than 150 Royal Navy, RAF and Army veterans urging the Queen to strip the Duke of York of his military titles, 